ver. A ver. We need to do certain. Ok. Yes. Uh, let's let, let, let just let me check if I didn't mess it up as when I selected the ta the, the data. For sure, I did. Very old. Yes, you see, I I screw this. Let's let's just do it again. Oh, chinga! Yeah, let's do it again. Yes. I want to do now. Look, here, here's my here's my table. No. No, no, no. Good for me. That's okay. As usual, it worked perfect. Ah, está. ¿Por qué no me sale esto, cara? Well, I, I use this one that.
limited. I want to have the, the, the file separated by commas. Okay, finally, I have it. I have it ready. So what I have here is a table with the IDs of, the, of each of the squares of the grid, and I have the values that the program obtained for each species in each, in each one of the squares of the grid. What I want to do now is to transform this table with values of uh, the different values of presence according to the number of records in a one zero in a presence absence matrix. So I, I'm going to name one f this field species number, and I'm going to make the program calculate the value of the number of species for each of the squares. Okay. It's, it's, in, it's in Spanish. Pero es que está... Sí, es counted, y aquí es cuenta. <coughs> Contar, contarse. Es count. If, and you see, uh, and you see here the help. We are in row number two. The, our values start in, in cell B2. Because remember, we have this, this big, big table. The, fir the first column is the ID of the square. And the first, and the first row is the, non the name of the species. So the, ra the range I want to, to count is B2. Two, DN2. The criteria is if different from zero. I'm, I'm, count, I'm counting, okay? So, it's, is that okay? And with control, control clicking, I have now the values of species, species richness for each of the squares in my grid. So I save it before something else happens. And what I want to do is import this table to my view in our view. That happens say table add Camera B. Okay. Now I have the table joined into my view. Now what I want to do is, look, I have this table that contains all the, all the values of this, for each of the species in, in presence, absence, and, and the total. I want to add the total number of species to my, to my view to this theme that is the grid that I generated for my analysis. So I'm going to open the table. just disappeared. And what I, what I want to do is join the values of this table that I just generated to the, the original table that has the values of ID of the of the of the grid. So what I do is click in ID that is the field that I want 
that I want the, the two databases to communicate with and say join, hope it works. It worked. Okay? What I have now, I have co these two tables connected through the ID of the square. This way for me is very easy to obtain a map of the species richness of the region I was trying to do. And I can classify. <sighs> Worked. I can classify in the number of Maravilla, wonderful. Ah. So, the, it was, was it clear? Be, besides uh, the complications of the old computer and the stupidity of the one that is doing this, was it easy? So, were you, will, will you be, be able to generate something similar? Because Thiago wants, that's, that's the second part of the homework. Tiago wants this kind of data for his part that is tomorrow. So why don't you do, th do this thing? Is that okay? No? Can you just run through these things again one more time? Sure. Okay, different country. I don't know the names of the countries I'm working with. <laughs> so for me it's the same. <laughs> this, no. this looks like San Luis Potosí, <laughs> state in Mexico. Okay, I want to do... No, this I know which one is. But whatever, whatever. Congo. Nobody from Congo? Okay, so let's do it. First, we select my area, and I select, I, I construct the grid that I want to do. We want to construct a polygon. Now that we, now that we selected the polygon, we want to do, we, we want to add the values of side of the, of the squares that I want to work with. Could be two degrees, one degrees, could be 30 minutes. For reasons of easiness. And I draw the grid just to make sure that is the resolution I want to work with. This is one degree. I'm going to do two degrees. What happened here? Okay. Are we happy with this? 